Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is your boy Lewis right here. Today I'm going to be doing a quick exploration on the uh, MSI Dragon Center. Now, in this case, I have a GL6385 c laptop. But overall, most of the uh, Dragon Centers are pretty much identical. So that's coming up, okay? So stick around. All right, so what I'm about to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and launch this uh, Dragon Center. One of the most important things that you can do with the uh, with the software okay so okay so this is like per se your main dashboard right here as you can see it shows the model that I was telling you which is the GL 6385C and our CPU GPU memory usage you can go ahead and uh, free up some memory with that just click right there which is free up memory as you can see it's going down so uh, you can go ahead and clean up your disk as well as you can you clean you go ahead and click that right there and the uh, disk cleanup utility is gonna go ahead and uh, show up right here and then you can go ahead and start cleaning up some of your temporary files so that's that and then okay a very very important feature is gonna be this one right here right when you first buy your laptop this option is going to be selected meaning that it's not going to charge any more than 50 percent it's going to go ahead and stop at 60 so you're probably wondering why is it not charging more than that so if you want to go ahead and charge your laptop all the way to 100 percent go ahead and choose that option best for mobility and uh, you'll be able to see your battery charge all the way to 100 percent if you want to go ahead and uh, just charge it to about a 70 or or 80% it's gonna be this option I recommend this option right here it's gonna be balanced so that's the feature right there so there's a lot of people that have problems with that okay I mean, uh, I actually made another video earlier this year where um, I show how to charge the uh, laptop so. and another important feature that you can do it's right here you're definitely gonna want to go ahead and check out this option right here you're gonna, definitely going to want to do this every three months which is the battery calibration and uh, as you can see right there MSI recommends doing battery calibration every three months to have the best mo battery life so mine was actually done yesterday so I don't have to do this again until three months whenever you go ahead and do this try to have a little bit of time because it's going to take you about an hour and a half or so because it's going to go ahead and uh, first uh, uncharge your battery and then it's going to go ahead and recharge it again so yeah it'll take you about a good hour hour and a half so make sure you do that about once every three months and your battery is going to stay in top shape so I'll go ahead and do that and then right here you can do the uh, backup as well and uh, not all right here this is another important feature if you're playing video games and so you notice that your computer is getting you know warm it's just you know lagging and so uh, you want to go ahead and cool it real, real quick you can go ahead and do that manually right there where it says fan speed change it to cooler booster right there look you can probably even hear the the fan and then just go ahead back go back to auto and that's how you can go ahead and just uh, put it back so you you know just kind of go through this and uh, that's the main dashboard right there the you that's where you can go ahead and turn off and on your your fan battery you can go ahead and adjust that and uh, right here this is the the voice boost you can go ahead and turn it on and right here you can go ahead and scan that with your the QR code and the right here so that's about it right there that's pretty much what covers your MSI Dragon Center those are the most important things you can do you can do a couple more things but those are like the things that pretty much stand out so all right I hope you like this video that's my time right here for this one so make sure you like and subscribe and uh, I will see you on the next tutorial okay thanks a lot